Do you struggle when making latte art? Let me share with you an important coffee tool that you need to learn and master perfectly that will enable you grow and make better latte art on your cup of coffee. Working as a barista, I've seen many beginner baristas and home baristas struggle when they are making latte art on their cup of coffee and it's because of the milk jug they are using to pour the latte art on the cup of coffee. Let me explain. Milk jug is an important coffee tool that helps you in the process of making latte art and without a milk jug you can't be able to make any latte art on your cup of coffee because milk jug is where we pour our milk and steam it to create that perfect milk texture but also to create a good latte art on our cup of coffee. Let me share with you the basic knowledge that you must know on the milk jug on how you can properly use it to make a good latte art on your cup of coffee. Starting with the first key feature that you're going to notice on the milk jug. This is the different sizes of the milk jug. Recently, I was able to purchase these three milk jugs to use in our coffee shop while we are making the different latte art on our cup of coffee. We have different sizes. We have the big size and we have the medium size of the milk jug and we have the small size of the milk jug. This is because of the different sizes of cups that we use in our coffee shop when making the different coffee drinks. So you can't use a big milk jug when you're pouring latte art on a small cup of coffee. This is because you'll have too much milk in your milk jug which will prevent you to have control on your milk jug when you're pouring the latte art. This might also lead to much wastage of your milk. So it's better to use a small milk jug when you're pouring latte art on a small cup of coffee. And also you can't use a smaller milk jug when you're pouring latte art on a big cup of coffee. This will be impossible for you to fill up the cup of coffee if you're having less milk in your milk jug. The second key feature that you need to understand on the milk jug is the material of the milk jug. You don't need a milk jug which is stainless steel. Having a milk jug which is made out of a high quality stainless steel and thick enough, it will enable you to hold the temperature constantly when steaming your milk at a 70 degree temperature. This is good when you're texturing your milk because your milk jug won't heat up very fast. So it gives you enough time to steam your milk perfectly and create a good texture for making a good latte art on your cup of coffee. So if you use a milk jug with a low quality stainless steel which is very thin it won't enable you to heat up your milk to reach the desirable temperature because the milk jug will heat up very fast which will be uncomfortable for you not giving you enough time to texture your milk which will enable you to create a good latte art on your cup of coffee. The third key feature that you must know on a milk picture is the spulp. 80% of baristas agree that the spulp is the most important feature of the milk picture. It can easily determine how you can pour the different styles and designs of latte art. There are mainly two types of the spulp. We have the sharp spulp and the round spulp. The round spulp milk jug is the most common milk jug that you see in most of the cafes and even home baristas. They can pour the basic latte art designs on your cup of coffee like the heart, tulip, rosettas and the swan. For the sharp spulp, these are not very common. They are often used by the professional latte art baristas. Because of the sharpness of the spulp, it can easily control and restrict the flow of milk. That enables you to make advanced latte art designs like the seahorse, rabbit, horse and many more others. The fourth feature that you must know on a milk picture is the handle or the no handle milk jug. This is a big debate across the world with most of the baristas on which is the best milk jug when you're pouring latte art. Some of the baristas prefer jugs with no handles and some of the baristas prefer jugs with handles. But the most common milk jugs are the ones with handles. As for me, I love using jugs with handles. This is why I've made a full guide on how you can use these milk jugs for you with to watch this to video make a good latte if you find this video to be very Make useful, sure to stay until the end like of this button. video. 
If you have any question, comment below. I will be grateful to answer every question. Fort Key Future about milk jug is the different brands of milk jug. Different brands of the milk jug will give you best quality of the milk jug, which will enable you make better latte art on your cup of coffee. I use the Barista Space milk jug and it enables me make the different designs of latte art, from the basic latte art design to the advanced latte art designs. Here are some of the latte art designs I've made using the Barista Space milk jug. Check them out. After understanding these different features about the milk jug, you should watch this video next because it's a full guide on how you can hold the milk jug to be able to create a good latte art on your cup of coffee.